Hi, I'm John Trischler from Specialty Performance Parts, and today we're gonna show you our new universal cross mount. This is our second segment in our video series for our new bumper mount system for the Gen 3 Raptor. In this video, we're gonna show you the cross mount with some different rigid lights that you can choose to put on the front of your Raptor with this mount system. Uh, our previous video, if you haven't seen that yet, check that out. That includes some 40 inch light bars from Rigid, including the Radiance Full Size Radiance Plus and the Slim SR Series RGB Radiance light bar that you can put on the front of your Raptor as well. But again, we're gonna get started today and show you our universal cross mount with some light options from Rigid Industries. So let's go ahead and take a look at these lights and see what you think. All right, so these are the Rigid 360 Series six inch round lights. Now we've got two different types here. So you can get a spotlight version and you can get the driving pattern. So your spot pattern is gonna be long and narrow for your light beam and the driving pattern is gonna be kind of a mid-range, mid-distance width. It's gonna be very, very good for giving you full coverage of the road while driving, you know, at highway speeds. The 360 series also has an amber backlight, which is really popular, um, and that the amber backlight is on. It gives a nice accent to the front of your truck with your parking lights, your marker lights, and so on. You've got these amber lights. Um, so that's a really popular feature, and it's really cool with your 360s. Now these are the larger 360s, and for those that are concerned about camera blockage, you can see they do come up a little tall. If you put four of these on here, you can actually move them even further out if you wanted to, but you can move these out to the outer corners and you're gonna give yourself complete open area here for your camera for clearance. So this is one nice thing about doing two pairs of the 366 inch on that universal cross mount. You can move those to the outside and get yourself nice clearance for that front camera and still have a very, very bright set of lights on the front of your truck. You know, one thing that, uh, that, that a couple of people have asked is, you know, how much is going to sit in front of the bumper because they're concerned about their clearance into their garage. And it doesn't sit out that far. You can see it actually sits back pretty close to the, to the uh, depth of the bumper. You'll also notice on the front of the Gen 3 Raptor, um, the reason that these are a straight bar and, and our light bars we're using on the Gen 3s now are a straight light bar is because the front of the truck is very, very flat. There's a slight curve, but it's very, very flat. In the Gen 3 Raptor, instead of being a consistent curve around the whole front of the truck, it's very flat in the front and then it chisels and it angles back really sharp on the corners. So we're going to get some distant shots here so you can kind of see them with the backlights and with the main lights on. All right, so we're going to go ahead and pan out here real quick so you can get, a, you know, get an idea of how these look. Now we're gonna go into our next setup. We have 10 Radiance lights on our cross metal. Just like in our fog pockets, we have three on each side, so three pairs of Radiance lights. Up here on our cross mount, we put 10, so we've got five pairs on our cross mount. You've got a cool look with the amber backlight again and this square light for a, kind of a cool look here on your, your bumper. So this is another style that you can try for your Raptor. We're gonna go ahead and turn these on now so you can see what they look like. The Radiance lights, shoot out kind of in a triangular uh, pattern. So they're gonna kind of blast out from, from where they're at. They're gonna kind of angle out and into the distance to give you a full coverage area of what you're trying to light up. Uh, the Radiance lights are 900 lumens per light. And so you got 10 of them across here. So you're almost 10,000 lumens. You can also get the scene version, which look basically the same. The scene version though are 2,970 lumens. So if you want a lot more power out of that square look, um, and these are just examples again, look just like this. The scene version is gonna give you that 2,900 170 lumens per light. Our third set of lights we're going to show you are our Rigid 360 4-inch and we've got 10 of those across our universal cross mount. 
as well. So with 10 of these, the lumen count is gonna be very similar to what just four of our 366 inch series are gonna be. And so obviously this gives you a much different look, uh, but if you wanna just go for four of the, th the six inch version, um, you're gonna get very similar lumen count. The Radiance 360 series in the four inch also are available in a selective yellow lens in the SAE and the clear lens in the SAE as well. The SAE models don't have a, an amber backlight, but they are street legal. So if that's one of your concerns or if you want that selective yellow light for you know poor driving conditions, snow, fog, and rain, and so on, you can get that selective yellow in that 360 series in the SAE 4 inch. We're gonna go ahead and turn on these 4 inch 360 lights now so you can see what these look like all lit up. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't seen the first video again, check that out on our YouTube channel. Subscribe, you can see all the new videos we release. And again, um, check us out at spvparts.com to pick up these light kits for your Gen 3 Raptor. We've got a lot of different options that you may not have seen, so check us out again at spvparts.com.